Number 15. Big Island, Hawaii. Home to the giant manta rays, these behemoths can span 15 feet across, and these waters are one of the only places in the world where you can get up close and personal with them. They're most frequently spotted in Kiauho Bay, where the giant manta rays gather to feast off of clouds of plankton. They are completely unbothered by tourists and will even get right beside snorkelers during their nightly feeding sessions. It's a little bit like getting up close and personal with a mythical animal. They certainly don't look like creatures that should really exist. Number 14. Malaysian Borneo Sipadan Island Home to some of the most varied marine life in the world, this is because there are strong currents from the Celebes Sea that come right up to the island, making it the perfect home for both green turtles and hawksbill turtles. In fact, it's not uncommon to find upwards of 20 sea turtles on a single dive from South Point. The turtles aren't the only thing you can find at Sipadan. It's also home to sea cucumbers, rare sea stars, and the Trident's trumpet sea snail. You'll be able to lay eyes on marine life that is almost impossible to find anywhere else in the world. Number 13. Tisfjord, Norway Home to some truly arctic waters and some of the largest marine life in the world. That's right, orcas. 10-hour trips are run off the coast daily, where those who are confident in their abilities as a snorkeler can take a dip in the frigid waters and have a truly stunning encounter with these massive beasts. Safaris designed just to spot these massive orcas have been ongoing since the early 90s and remain a pivotal part of the Norwegian tourist industry. Number 12. Galapagos Islands, Ecuador Jump to the northern waters of the Galapagos Islands in Ecuador and you can find yourself with a chance to go swimming with sea lions. Even better is if you pop by during breeding season, you'll be able to spot some of their pups along with the adults. And don't forget that these waters are also home to marine iguanas, white tip reef sharks, and even penguins. Not to mention that the sea lions themselves are endemic to these islands, meaning that this species of sea lion can't be found anywhere else in the world. Despite the lion in their name, they eat almost exclusively fish that are native to the region. Number 11. Isle Malk Island in Micronesia If you go to Isle Malk Island in Micronesia, you'll find Jellyfish Lake. Like the name implies, this is the home to golden jellyfish. Their sting is so mild that it can't even be felt by humans, which means that swimmers are able to just go straight through the masses of thousands upon thousands of golden jellyfish without any worry. It's an experience that truly can't be found anywhere else in the world. The lake itself is actually too dangerous for scuba diving due to the high concentration of toxic hydrogen sulfide, but it's still perfectly safe to don a snorkel and go for a quick dip with these golden gelatinous orbs. Number 10. New Brunswick, Canada from Micronesia to New Brunswick, Canada, where you're able to take part in the salmon run. Guests are encouraged to swim alongside the traveling Atlantic salmon and help count their numbers. This is only possible during September, so it's a trip that you're going to want to make sure to plan for in advance. The salmon run is a huge part of the local culture, so you're bound to find some incredible on-land events to go to as well. Number 9. Ningaloo Reef, Australia for whale sharks and, of course, the chance to swim with them. These fish might be massive, but they're actually incredibly gentle. They're known for being the largest fish in the world, and you have to go through sustainable tours to be able to swim with them. Bonus points because you can also spot humpback whales in the region during the summer months. While you're in the area, make sure to check out some of the other landlocked lakes for the chain pickerel and muskies. Number 8. South Africa's Eastern Cape. For the sardine run, specifically, you can find this just off the shore of KwaZulu-Natal. It happens every year between May and July, where experienced snorkelers can watch millions of silvery sardines migrate north to warmer waters. Sometimes you'll even be able to spot bronze whaler sharks or dolphins come in to take advantage of the copious amounts of their natural prey. The dolphins and whaler sharks will push the sardines off in clusters for easy eating and are generally uninterested in the humans in the area. This natural phenomenon is highly recommended as something that any snorkeler or diver should 
absolutely attend at least once in their swimming career. There really is nothing like being surrounded by this silvery, glittering fish. Number 7. Madeira, Portugal Portugal's waters are home to countless creatures, but the dolphins that live around Madeira are some of the most well-known out of all of them. Over six different species of dolphins can be spotted here, among them the spotted dolphins, bottlenose dolphins, and both common and Atlantic dolphins. You might even be able to catch a sight of a sperm whale. You can see them year-round, but your best bet to actually swim with them will be a summer trip to Funchal Harbor, where a guided trip will all but ensure you a chance to spot at least one of these lovely dolphins. Number 6. Florida's Crystal River Known for its warm waters, clear springs, and its manatee population. In fact, this is actually one of the only places in the world where you can legally swim with manatees. During the winter, over 400 manatees are known to congregate in these waters. Some of them friendly enough that they'll come right up to see the divers that have gone into their waters. These good-natured animals are actually some of the most friendly that you can swim with. Florida is incredibly proud of its manatee population, and they're very protective about them as well. There are almost a thousand manatees killed by boats every year, so those who continuously come to the Crystal River are regarded with extreme care, caution, and love. Number 5. Churchill, Manitoba Home to ocean canaries. Never heard of them? You might recognize these animals by their more common name, beluga whales. They've gained this nickname from the way they sing like birds beneath the waters. And in the Hudson Bay, you'll be able to have your own personal beluga whale concert. Thousands of these cetaceans come to the bay to molt. That's right, they shed their skin once a year, much like a snake might. They're curious and often friendly, which means not only can you take a swim with them, but you can also get right near a pot of beluga whales with your kayak. Number 4. The Maldives The Maldives are already known for their network of coral atolls, but did you know that they were also the home to masses of manta rays? These channels are just deep enough that manta rays will come through to feed on the microscopic plankton that come in with the current at Hanifaru Bay. You can only swim with these magnificent creatures between May and November, right at the height of the monsoon season. While you're not allowed to go for a deep scuba dive, snorkelers are still able to catch glimpses of these creatures during their swims. Even more incredible is the fact that it's not just home to the world's largest population of reef manta rays, it is also home to a large population of oceanic manta rays. Number 3. Dyer Island, South Africa These waters are filled with both jackass penguins and cape fur seals. They're also one of the favored hunting grounds of great white sharks. They're just as incredible to see in real life as you're picturing and are often on the bucket list for divers all across the world. While you can see them from your boat as they breach the surface of the water, the real thrill comes from taking a cage dive straight into their swimming grounds. Number 2. Bahamas In the Bahamas, you can find two small islands called Bimini. These islands are best known for the wild dolphins that live in the waters surrounding the shores. These dolphins are so used to tourists coming out that it's common for them to come right over to those who have gotten into the waters. The only rule is that you're not allowed to actually touch them, no matter how much you want to or how close they get. They are primarily Atlantic spotted dolphins. They have their calves in Bimini, and then that calf will live out its life in the waters surrounding the island before repeating the pattern. It's a transforming experience to be able to swim alongside these wild dolphins and to see them enjoying life in their natural habitats. Number 1. The Magdalena Bay the Magdalena Bay can be found in Baja, California Sur in Mexico, and it's one of the most magical encounters you can ever have. Every winter, gray whales come to the bay in the hundreds because the protective nature of the lagoon is an ideal location for these gray whales to give birth. Fishing in the bay is strictly prohibited, but if you plan ahead of time, you can take a licensed tour out of the small panga boat and have an experience that you will never forget. Where would you like to go and swim with sea life? Let us know in the comments below. 